welcome back to my channel uh today i thought i i would make a tutorial on how to how on how i do my brows so you know brows can be a little bit tricky and some days you do it and then it's perfect and the other days you like go just go wipe that off go 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 wipe that off so i hope i don't mess this up <laughs> i really hope i don't mess it up but i'm gonna try to do my brows on or show you guys or how i do my brows so as you can see i have um i a pencil at the moment so with a uh this is supposed to be a damp cotton wool so but then i i just realized i didn't have any cotton wool so i'm just gonna use this tissue i folded it up into a four sections so i'm just gonna spritz some water just to make it damp Okay, see, it's damp now, and then I'm just gonna wipe my brows off and hope that it comes off. Comes off. I'm gonna take a dry cotton because this was a little bit too wet so I'm just gonna wipe the excess water off okay so as you can see um, a couple of years ago I did um, what back then it, it used to be um, back then it was called um, permanent tattooing so in 2010 if I'm not mistaken I did my brows what we called a permanent tattoo now we like upgraded to microblading and that's what it's called nowadays it's microblading so as you can see I'm still stuck with the line and then back then the line used to be the thing when you were trending when you had a straight line of a permanent uh, tattoo or if you drew your brows and it was just a straight line you used to be the top notch but nowadays not anymore okay so I am stuck with this so I've been working ever since I um, left college. Yeah, ever since I've left um, my college years, and then this side it faded. So as you can see, this side there's 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 no tattoo, but this side was so stubborn, and it was done so wrong it was all the way up there if you can see my brows go like that but this side the person just chose to uh, put the line all the way up there so I have to now wax my brows so that you know it complements that line you know and then cover it up by uh, using a pencil or a lip liner or whatever so yeah this is my current situation and it looks like it's gonna be my forever situation unless I, if I get some chmoolas <laughs> to go and do a laser because this is a, a laser is the only thing that can be able to get rid of this Otherwise, I've, I've tried so many things that people uh, have recommended, but it's not working. But this side, I was so lucky it came off. But yeah. 
so let's get uh, into the video so firstly I use what is meant to be a big brush brow brush brow brush <laughs> but it, it broke off so I'm still using it there's no way I'm gonna throw this away so I brush my brows up and then I use this um, pencil I got this from um, uh, Tlex, I think, if I'm not mistaken. I think I got this from Tlex. I'm not sure. It's, it's been a while. Uh, it's uh, from Huda, Huda Beauty. Huda Beauty. So, I firstly sharpen my pencil up. You don't want it to be too sharp, otherwise it will break off. And I start making a borderline underneath my brows. And then I make another borderline on top of my brows. I try to carve as much possible or as much as I can uh, so that this doesn't show the permanent tattoo doesn't show And then I take this brow bar brush um, and then other people use a concealer but I once bought this foundation and it was a, a wrong color skin tone so I've been using this to um, uh, contour my brows so I use this foundation instead it works the same So I just thicken a little bit and then just put it on my hand and then I take with a brush and then I'm gonna clean underneath I don't do the top part I don't normally do the top part I only clean uh, the bottom part and then and then i use my beauty blender i use the pointy side because i feel it gets more closer into the eye to clean underneath uh, my brows just to blend the rest of my foundation slash concealer I went ahead and did the other side uh, to be honest there is no master of perfect brows uh, you do your brows the way you feel it looks good when you do them uh, you can look at this and call out like that is like a crap whole lot of brows and I can say the same for your brows so really just do what's comfortable or what you comfortable uh, uh, with so as long as you're not gonna go around looking crazy I look like I have a nice head house if I make sense anyway this is the finished result
time. Hope you like, comment, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you want to see more videos from me. Like this video if it was any of help. Tell your mama, your auntie, your brother, your sister, your dog that you know what? I'm talking about I've been here doing brows. So you, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. See you again in my next video.